Hey everyone, it's Kristen Burt with Red Carpet Report. Tonight we are in Beverly Hills for the 16th Annual Prism Awards, which honors the accurate depiction of social issues in TV and film. Let's see who walks down that yellow carpet. All right, what category are you presenting tonight? Uh, I'm presenting Best TV Miniseries. And uh, have you had a, an interest in the PRISM Awards before or an understanding of what they're all about? You know what, the PRISM Awards were new to me, but because of the show that I'm doing, Touch, you know, I'm playing a social worker, and so social issues have always been, you know, an interest to me. So, um, and, and being from the UK, I, I hadn't heard of them until more recently. But, you know, I just found out they've been going for 16 years and promoting awareness of um, substance abuse and mental health. So, you know, I think it's such a, a worthwhile and interesting award. Different, different to the, your regular award show, you know. As usual, we're like, yeah. we're just here to get dressed up and yeah, applaud each other. Yeah, time. it has more of a social conscience. And I think, you know, that's really inspiring, the fact that, you know, people can become more aware of these issues, perhaps be inspired to get involved and maybe, you know, dispel, dispel some of the taboos um, about mental health and substance abuse. Do you find that certain storylines on Touch have really resonated with the show's viewers? Yeah, for sure. Um, I mean, uh, you know, obviously uh, Jake, uh, played by David Mazouz, who is Kiefer Sutherland's son in the show, has special needs. Um, my character, um, we'll see in the episode that's airing tonight, actually, that um, her mother has uh, schizophrenia. And so she grew up um, very much with an awareness of that. And so I, I was able to, do, fortunate enough to do a lot of, of research into that and, um, you know, what it, it might be like to grow up with a, a, a parent who... Uh, um, is not really able to, to parent, you know, in, in, in a typical way. So, um, so for sure, yeah, there's been a lot of um, moments in that, and also. Um you know, the show also deals with um, people who are homeless as well and, and various um, mental health issues. I mean, the, the theme of the show is, you know, it has its magical moments as well, but 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 it does um, deal with those issues too. Yeah, mental illness is something that sometimes people don't want to talk about and it's important to get it out there. Yeah, exactly. And as I say, that's what's been so exciting about Touch. We really confronted some of those issues there. So hopefully it will broaden people's awareness. All right. Tell us one story about Kiefer working with... Come on. He... Every time I turn around, he's got a good story in the news, so you must yeah, have a fun I one know. from set. I don't have anything particularly fun. You know what really surprised me about him? He play, He's a, like an avid chess player. Um, he likes to play chess on the set, you know, um, between takes and stuff. I still haven't learned, so um, I'm going to have to learn so I can thrash him one of these days. Um, but, but yeah, that, that was a surprise to me. Yeah, I wouldn't have expected that. It seems very serious and focused. I yeah, like it. Yeah, it is. Not very rock and roll, but it's true. <laughs> well, fantastic. Thank you so much for talking with us. Thank